Well, you're looking at the angel stone. Um, and if you're wondering, oh, it's just a little bit of stone carved in Manchester Cathedral. You'd be wrong to just dismiss it so easily. Um, it actually dates to over 800 years old and was found during a Victorian excavation of the South Porch. Now, there's lots of clues as to why it is of that age, and we've had experts come in and tell us why we know it's that old. But how did it get here? Was there a church on this site? We know we go back at least to the 1300s, but do we go back further? Maybe you have to come in and find out. Well, this choir is one of the absolute joys, not only of this cathedral, but of this city and of Europe, I would say. Um, if you were here in the 1400s and you were part of the College of Priests who were here, you would be saying prayers all day for hours and hours. But people thought about the priests of the time and, and their comfort. So when is a seat not a seat? When it's a misericord. What's a misericord? Misericord is from the Latin for pity. It's a pity seat so that the priest could prop their derrieres against the seat and look as though they were standing praying when in fact they were able to rest. But one of the glories of the misericords is the carvings underneath. So if you come into the cathedral, you can miss anything, but don't miss this. Um, some great engravings, many of them satirical, cartoonish, poking fun at medicine men of the day. But one of my personal favourites is this depiction here under this misericord, which shows, and it's still exquisite in its detail, two gentlemen playing backgammon. And we think this is one of the earliest representations in Western art of this being um, played. Absolutely wonderful. But there's loads more. Come and have a look under our seats is our invitation to you. What you're looking at is a cathedra um, and how to win friends and influence people. The way you know you're in a cathedral is there will always be a cathedra, which is the bishop's seat. Um, you might be thinking, why are there two kangaroos here hogging on a bishop's seat? Ah, well, we have the answer for that, but maybe you have to pop in and see us to find out and find out what our connections are with the other side of the world that put these two kangaroos on the bishop's chair.